right, y'all, this is going to be the last video I made about this subject. Floyd Mayweather is going to fight Manny Pacquiao, May 2nd. It's going to be a long, boring fight. You know, Floyd Mayweather has long, boring fights. Last time Floyd had an exciting fight is when he was at 135 because he's not going to knock anybody out at 147. He's not going to knock Manny Pacquiao out. And Manny Pacquiao is not going to knock him out. Manny Pacquiao rarely ever knocks out anybody that comes in, comes in, uh, in shape. He didn't knock out Tim Bradley. He knocked out De La Hoya because De La Hoya was struggling with his weight. He knocked out Miguel Cotto because Miguel Cotto does not watch his weight. Miguel Cotto always has to fight the scale first, then he has to fight his opponent. Manny Pacquiao didn't knock out Tim Bradley. Who, I mean, everybody's so excited about this fight, but it's a big fucking, everybody's so excited about this fight, but if it asks me, it's a big ass scam. That's all it is, because they'll probably have a, a rematch. But Manny Pacquiao is not going to outbox Floyd Mayweather. You know, it's not like Floyd has a problem with Southpaws. The guy's been fighting since he was eight fucking years old, man. Manny Pacquiao, you know, Manny Pacquiao only fights one way, coming forward. He's predictable. It's not like he has a different style. It doesn't, it's not like he knows how to set fighters up. All he does is weigh you down with a, with a relentless suit of punches. But Floyd Mayweather, I mean, it's not like Manny Pacquiao is going to come with something that Floyd hasn't seen before. He's not going to outbox him. I said the only, like I made in the videos before, I said the only way to beat Floyd Mayweather is to keep pressure on him and make him fight. But it's not like Manny Pacquiao is a great boxer. He just comes and he throws punches one way. He, he has quick feet, he moves from side to side, and he throws combinations. And that's it. But the only time Manny Pacquiao has ever stopped anybody is when he was fighting a scale. He didn't stop Sugar Shane Mosey. He stopped De La Hoya, like I said, because De La Hoya was fighting a scale. Cotto was fighting a scale. And he didn't stop Tim Brady. So like I said, the fight is going to go the distance. It's going to be a long, boring fight with expressive excitement. And Floyd Mayweather's going to win by split decision. Real simple.